It's a good time for a new quote anyways. Right. Now, were you saying earlier that we should, you should move, change companies? Well, here, here's you what you that? might consider. It depends on how well you know your insurance agent or broker or the insurance company that mm -hmm. you were with because a lot of times what will happen is, is since you were a household together, that when it gets split apart, not everything within the insurance company is always going to be picked up correctly. So as a result, you still may have some of your personal stuff going to your ex-spouse. I've had, had have dealt with this with um, divorced couples mm -hmm. where they are very adamant, I don't want anything about me going to him or right. anything about me going to her. And um, so one thing to consider is that if you're going through that process is maybe taking it to a different carrier or maybe just a different broker if you want to stay with the same carrier just to eliminate the chances of, of that information being found. You know, one of the things you're going to run into is when you split up the household like that or split up the cars, you may find your rates changing a little bit. And, and the reason is, is most companies give discounts um, when you have multiple cars with them. Well, when you split it out and become two separate accounts, then what happens is that discount falls off. So it's another reason to look for quotes at that time mm. or look for, you know, at the coverage just because all these things are happening at once, it's just a perfect time to take a look. So the comment you just made about staying with the same, changing carriers, but staying with the same broker, they couldn't do that through one of these companies like I had before, but with you, they could keep you as the broker, change carriers, am I understanding that correctly? Yeah, I don't, I don't want to mislead anybody. Yeah. You, if you're with a company, and, and I'll mention names, a State Farm, mm -hmm. a Farmers, the Allstate, the, the big companies out there, yeah. all those companies allow you to change your agent if you want to change your mm. agent to help split apart your household. Okay. As a broker, you can do the same thing. Mm -hmm. What a broker will allow you to do though is maybe see about changing the company altogether if gotcha. there's a better deal for you. Mm -hmm. Some companies are better if you have kids on the policy. Well now if you're single without the kids on the policy, there may be a better option for you as a single individual than there was as, with a family as kids. So those are the sorts of things that a broker can bring to the table. Gotcha. Well that's very good.